and welcome to my first budget crafts test and review. So this month I am going to show you this foil art. It's a set I got for £3 from the works. Um, it's to use for card making, scrapbooking, decorating, things like that. So it's only £3, so it's under the £5 budget that I get. <laughs> and from the looks of it you get 10 rolls of foil and you get the instructions which are pretty simple and you get a glue pen you get 10 meters of um, foil so that's a meter for each color and pretty much from the instructions um, what you have to do is take the glue pen draw on your design onto your paper or card take the foil place it on top once the glue has gone clear and then just pull it off and the foil should stay on the page hopefully so I will test that one out I've never done used foil before so I'm not quite sure how this is going to turn out we're feeling it's going to be pretty bad though so I've already got a drawing out so I just drew a little minion and you've got to do one colour at a time so I'm just going to cover all the sections that I want yellow with the glue pen it comes out pretty quickly so don't squeeze too much to get the glue out because otherwise you just end up with a big glob so that's one thing already maybe feels a simpler way to put the glue on pen does seem simple but yeah so it comes out pretty kind of creamy coloured and apparently you've got to wait until it goes white so it's got to dry and kind of go clear. So I'll wait and do that. It did take, felt like I was waiting forever and on the camera it does actually look still quite creamy and that's probably why it didn't work first time. <laughs> so once you've done that you place the full foil on top. Then you press it down, make sure it's on the glue, and then you pull it off. So that is really simple to do, and voila, nearly, no, not that one, nearly, wait. <laughs> long story short, mine didn't work first time, I did not wait long enough to, for the glue to dry. It literally just dried around the outside. It felt like I was waiting for ages though and it had gone tacky so I thought it was going to work so I had to try it again. By then I'd smudged the glue so that's why it's not as neat. So I'm going to try it again with the trouser parts of the, uh, the dungaree part. But while I'm waiting for the glue to dry I'm just going to try something else. So I've got some double sided sticky tape here which I'm just going to cut out in the shape of a balloon, stick on the card. I'm going to pull off the backing and then use that with the foil instead and see how that comes out. I'm just pressing it down on the sticky tape and then it came off by itself. So this actually gives a better defined line and obviously you don't have to wait for glue to dry so that might be something I might try with some projects. And I just have to wait for the rest of the glue to try that. So far it's not been too bad, It's, I think it's something I'm going to have to try quite a few times before I get the hang of it. So overall it's not too bad for £3, you get a fair amount of foil. So I'll wait for the, ju uh, ju the glue to dry a little longer. It did work a bit better this time but like I said I'd already smudged the glue so I didn't actually um, stay in within the lines that I wanted it to. As you can see if it misses a bit there you just take the foil and put it on again and it should cover it up. So I'm gonna try this some more on some like scrap paper, try some little projects, see how it goes before I'm gonna actually use it on any birthday cards or anything. Because it's a nice idea. It's nice and shiny. I'm just not very good at it at the moment. 
And then once you've done the bits you want to do with the foil, you can just then colour in or add detail, however you want. I kind of gave up with this card, so <laughs> that's why it's not very good. So yeah, overall it's not too bad. I think if I'd have spent like a £10 on it, I'd have been like, nope, that's rubbish. But considering it was only £3, it's not too bad. It's not a bad thing to just test as well. See, so it's all shiny. See, the balloons come out a lot more sharper. I'll use the um, double-sided sticky tape for that. But not too bad for my first try. So, thanks for watching. I'll see you next month for another budget crafts review and testing. Thanks. Bye.